And the, uh, the last uh, feature I wanted to talk about was uh, one of our unique features, the adjustable plate coalescer. And uh, the multi-pack is a pack in which you can field adjust the plate gap. It's unique in the industry for that. And what I mean by that is you can actually pull plates or add plates in the field to meet a certain field condition. Whether your flow rate's increasing and you have to deal with that, or the solids loading's increasing, or down the road when the efficiency requirements um, increase, you can deal with that by adding plates. We ship, typically, we ship a plate pack with every other plate in place. By doing that, we give the versatility of upgrading if there's the need or um, you can pull plates out if they're so high solids that the problem is in maintenance. So, for instance, we can pull out, say, every other plate on our coalescer plate pack system in the field. So you can see here that if we do that, we're able to change the plate gap in the field. So if this were every, other, if this were every plate in place and we pulled it out, now instead of, say, a quarter inch gap or half inch gap, we could double that to one inch. We can go from any five six inch, five sixteen inch right, an right angle gap all the way up. So that translates into half inch gap increments vertically. So as you can see here, much more, ga much more gap in this area than this area. This will foul less. This is going to be more efficient. So by pulling every other plate system out here, We've changed the uh, fouling characteristics of the plate pack. Now, had we needed more efficiency in the field, we could have added plates, say, throughout. And by adding plates, we're going to double up the surface area and squeeze out more efficiency for the effluent requirements. The other thing that we've seen done in the field, uh, you have to put a little time and energy to do this, but if you keep track of the fouling in a plate pack system, you can actually find areas where the more solids are going to be. For instance, typically near the very bottom of the pack or up near a sludge layer on the top. If you, play, if you strategically pull plate gaps, you can keep a high efficiency in one area while in an area where there may, there may be more fouling, you can pull plates just in that area. And by doing that, you kind of get the best of both worlds. The other thing we've done, kind of unique, is um, we've also built plate pack systems where as the plates go through, we actually can increase the, uh, the number of plates as you go through the plate pack. So the front of the pack is designed to pull out the heavier solids, and as you drift through the pack with your wastewater, there are more plates in place back here. And by doing that, we can uh, have a very high efficiency and a very low maintenance uh, system that uh, will be good for years to come in the, um, in, in the effluent requirement that uh, industry may find.